Oh, hold on. Um, QBM there to show on the keyboard. Okay, now before I explain my code, I will show the results. Of course, that I am inspired by the Kodami Lesson 62 on showing keyboard. Of course, I change some of the settings and some of the programs. Uh, for example, in the original uh, lecture, they show the keyboard immediately and without the key view file, but I uh, modify that with the showing the keyboard using the um, KVMD um, button and I will show the keyboard and I can close it okay and that's some of the, of the I think it is a certain kind of uh, improvement here suppose that I type it the capital letter and as it became the I, I can't do the shift okay therefore I use the cap lock here the lazy dark um jump no it's uh, not lazy dog right the lazy dog jump over there at uh, the quick fork is what I can't remember but anyway just an example over jumps over the quick fork I'm not sure I can't remember or just the opposite, I don't know. So I got um in the original lecture there's uh, there's there's only some example in the keystroke and now and I, I got it fully functionable. I was uh tap here, I was uh cap lock, space bar, return, everything included. And even this escape key I would close the keyboard that one and I can show it to guy and uh and then, then whatever it is, okay. <coughs> now I explained the logic or the flow. Again I have a code um maybe I separate the two windows and here is uh, the code the Python code and that is the KV file. The KV file, that I have uh, a box layout, a vertical box layout with the label, and the label will show the results at what the lecture is uh, also suggested. And then I have uh, another box layout to hold for, uh, as a placeholder for the keyboard. Orientation not important here, I can remove it. And then get a, get a button, a nice KVMD button. And I have a function called press. Okay, when I press it, it comes to the press, and it depend on the text on the button. If the button is show, which is a nice show keyboard. If not, a close keyboard. Uh, okay, before that, I would have to build, and that is the code for um, showing the keyboard immediately for the screen for the KV. But uh, I remove it and I use a placeholder to show and close the keyboard. This is something different from the lecture. And now that is the part <coughs> that I thank to the, keep to the lecture very much because with the, all the code, I basically the concept I copied from the lecture, otherwise I would never able to write this one. Um, having said that, I modified the part and I was, uh, see the escape key, then I return none. Actually, the returning is not necessary. It is a dummy. But I use it so that I have, um, I no need to do, uh, too much deep into the L's, the LF and so on. I, I, I don't need it. Okay, I just use the return statement and everything after that can be the same level in dense level, and so that's very nice. I don't know why and I press uh, the key is that it become none. I don't know, maybe the box there, uh, then I change it to that from here, and that backspace, nothing, 
And this one, I also thank to the lecturer uh, for teaching this. There was just um, a slice of the text from the beginning to the last one before left. Okay. Then for space more nothing, enter a, a backslash N, tap backslash T, a shift. I omit this part first and use cap lock. And cap lock is kind of a toggle. I make a self variable. Okay. And it does a key nothing. And you get a key here. And if the self cap lock, I could get an upper a key value, okay? And then I would add the original text value with the key and then a dummy line only. Okay, so all you know is not too difficult. And the logic is basically the same at the intellectual, only with my uh, supposed to be um, certain kind of improvement that I don't have to load the keyboard immediately because you may not need the keyboard sometimes to the, you to write in the app or you can break it up only when necessary or can you type something and you can close it and if you need it again you can write it and you have a return um, cap lock tab cap lock everything okay backspace hmm basically not working no, no, that's okay. Oh, that's way it's not necessary. Anyway, that's that not difficult. I can uh, uh, fix it. But anyway, that is the basic logic. And thank you very much for listening to my sharing of this, of this uh, course. And hope to uh, share other experiences. And also, I'm glad that I'm uh, almost uh, close to the end of the lecture of the Kodami on the KV and KVMT. And very soon, I, I think I'm able to write an app in uh, Android and iOS using KV. I've learned Flutter before, but I, uh, because I love Python so much that I uh, f let go Flutter. Because uh, the language is comparing to Python. I think Python is more suitable to me. And anyway, but even in Flutter I use Emacs. Um, I wrote a lot of uh, Lips code to facilitate the writing of uh, Flutter also. The Emacs really good. Okay. Well, suppose I want to insert anything. I a canvas layout which is everything I can hear. Okay. Okay, thank you. Have a good evening. Bye.